Everyone, this is FaZe and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm actually really excited because Apple just dropped beta 2 of iPadOS 26.1 and they brought back a feature that a lot of us have been missing for quite some time. You see, when Apple introduced iPadOS 26, they brought all new multitasking features and we all immediately fell in love with the all new app window management system when it came to multitasking. But you see, Apple also removed a feature that we all really loved and that's called slide over. And I know I was not the only one disappointed when Apple removed that feature because a lot of people in the comments section below for quite some time, whenever I would drop videos on all the latest betas of iPadOS 26, everyone was hoping and praying for slide over to return. And just a few weeks back, iPadOS 26 officially released for everyone worldwide and there was no slide over. But I'm very happy to say with beta two of iPadOS 26.1, Apple has brought it back. Sort of, kind of. It's not exactly the same, but it is slide over at the same time. But anyways, instead of me just talking about it, let me show you how it works. So as you can see, I am running the developer beta of iPadOS 26.1 beta 2. This just released and I have it downloaded. All right, so let's say I want to open up Instagram as a slide over application, right? So here I have Instagram open. Basically, what you want to do is go into the traffic light symbols, right, right over here and hard click on the green icon. And then you're going to see an all new option called enter slide over. So you click on that and voila, it slides to the right and you have it right then and there. And you just basically use all your other applications. And this is just basically hovering over all those applications. So it doesn't really matter how many applications you have open. They, it's just basically, you know, on top. And what's cool is you can resize this slide over as well. So you can have it like so, you can have it smaller, you can put it on the bottom, any side technically, and it's always just going to stay there on top. But here's the cool part. If I just take this and slide it like that, it hides away. If I want to bring that slide over app back, I just do that. And whoa, that was a really fast one. But here it is. The slide over application just pops up. So once again, I just swipe it, it goes away and I just bring it back just like that. And unfortunately, it only works with one application. So you know, before slide over would have multiple different applications, you can swipe up and then you would see all your apps open and you can choose which one you want in slide over. No, it's just one app at a time. So yeah, that is slide over. All right, guys, so that basically wraps up my demo on how slide over works with iPadOS 26.1 beta 2. Now, I do want to mention that this is beta for iPadOS 26.1, which hasn't officially released yet. And to be honest, I don't really know how many betas we're going to get for iPadOS 26.1. But there are chances of the way we're seeing slide over right now to improve with beta 3 or beta 4. Like one of the things that I really wanted was the option of having multiple apps in slide over like before, but we can't do that right now but who knows with beta 3 or 4 we might get that so at the end of the day i want to know your thoughts are you excited that apple has brought back slide over with ipad os 26.1 or you're kind of disappointed with the way it works and how we don't have multiple app support so whatever thoughts you have whatever questions you have leave them down in the comment section below subscribe to my channel for all things apple and productivity and i'll catch you in the next one